You know when you have a big goal that you have for yourself and it's like so big that it scares you? Like you're like, how the heck am I going to make this happen? How the heck am I going to do this? And it scares you so much that it almost like paralyzes you. Like you, you're frozen in fear about like what the next step to take is because like the goal is so big and so overwhelming that you're like, how the heck am I going to make this happen? God reminded me today that the reason why I often get that scared about my goals is because one, I think I have to do it by myself. I have to make it come to fruition by myself and I forget that he's with me. And two, I'm too focused on the big picture that I'm not like focusing on what I already have at my disposition to make, to take the next step. And so because I'm focused on like the big picture and the big goal and where I'm going, I'm missing I'm missing what he has already given me to take the next step. And so I hope this encourages you today that one, you're not alone. You don't have to make that big goal happen by yourself. God is with you every single step of the way. And two, don't focus on the big picture. Start taking inventory of what God has already given you. What's already at your disposition was already available to you to take the next step. Focus on that. The Bible asks us to be faithful over the little and God will provide a lot more. So if you're faithful over what he has already given you, the next steps will be, will be given to you and you can go forward and take that next step.